here comes Sami Zayn. Underdog no more. He has reached main event status. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Montreal, Quebec, Canada. Weighing in at 212 pounds. Sami Zayn! Listen to the energy in here for Sami Zayn. Sami never gives less than 100% in the ring. The WWE Universe is on their feet for Sami Zayn. The voice of the voiceless has returned. Forget the night of Punk's historic return. But now, Punk must prove himself. Says he's now home, but many competitors have said this is no longer his home. Punk has never been more focused. He's now down to business, and he wants to rewrite his legacy and write a whole new chapter in the WWE. Sami Zayn has seen and done it all, which means that this man has got to be prepared for everything and anything. There's the bell and more evidence that hell has frozen over. CM Punk is all set for action. A lot of people never thought CM Punk would return, me included. But it's great to see him back in the WWE ring. I'm sure he used his time away to hone and perfect his game. There's no doubt that Punk worked on improving himself in every sense. The second city Saint is difficult to compete with. And standing across the ring from him is an incredible competitor in Sami Zayn. When that bell rings and Sami goes in, he leaves it all. Submission top. And he makes it to the ropes. I knew he could. There is some power behind that punch. Side out. We're going to finish it off. Swan Tone Bomb! And that can end up putting CM Punk on shaky legs for a bit. Zayn capitalized on that opening when it appeared. Any good tips for taking out a grizzled veteran like CM Punk? Someone who has gone head to head with all time greats? Punk may have a ton of invaluable experience, but it took him plenty of mileage to get it. And that adds up. I'd target his joints, any old battle wounds, those places where the years of competition have really taken a toll. Good God, didn't need to counter into anything pretty, just a clubbing blow. Sends his opponent to the outside of the ring, which cannot be good because he's got more plans in store. Tornado DDT! Unbelievable athleticism. Just going for it all and landing a direct hit. Counter by CM Punk. CM Punk doing what he can to halter the beatdown. Time now for CM Punk to get his energy up and claw back into the fight. Zayn's feeling it. This is a clever strategy, trying to go after Punk's old battle wounds and exploit all his years of competing in the ring. On oh, a stop. 
This match is brutality starting to show on him. Sammy putting his mind to work and finding a good opening there. It's always great to be back in NXT. Yeah, I couldn't agree more, Michael. NXT has been such a pivotal point for many superstars in WWE. Sami Zayn with a big boot. Is Zayn closing this out? Cover! The superstar enjoying his victory. And the loser of this match offering a handshake. How about that? The winner oh. has uh, no interest. I beat oh. you. Get out of my ring. Okay, how, about that? how hard would it have been just to shake the man's hand? Because it's not about feeling, Saxon. It's about victory. It's about winning and staying on top at all costs. Is Trick Willie? The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Columbia, That's South right, Carolina. Right. Weighing in at 205 pounds. Trick Willie! He may be abrasive, but Trick has proven to be the kind of friend we all wish we had. Though that mouth has also earned him quite a few enemies. Here's a man who's already achieved so much in his young career. And his opponent from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 220 pounds. Austin Theory! A dominant competitor, but terrible at the commentary table. It looks like Theory brought all of his friends in the ring with him tonight. Oh, watch your mouth, Cole. You are looking at the youngest United States champion and Mr. Money in the bank ever. How did that cash in go? Well, that... I can't... Well, I, I don't have that information readily available. 
Usually the guys at 2K are great about giving me the stats. I, I, I'll get back to you. Ready to live in the now. Austin Theory has had quite the career so far. The youngest United States champion of all time. Say what you want about him, but Theory's abilities are nothing short of amazing. And the sky is the limit for someone of Theory's caliber. Not that there are many superstars of his caliber. There's no telling just how far Austin Theory will go with this kind of career trajectory. He's got Trick Williams staring him down, and I gotta say, you can't overstate just how hungry of a competitor Williams is. Yeah, Trick's obviously spent a good portion of his time here as a hype man, but that doesn't mean he's destined to stay in the background forever. You can tell he has a lot to prove, and tonight could be sink or swim time. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Oh, he got him! His and he's just in reach of the ropes and gets it to force the break. The ropes become a competitor's best friend in desperate moments like that one. We saw that one coming. Theory sidesteps. Boom, running FTO plants him. Nicely done. Punch right in the head. Oh, what a wind up. Austin Theory has such an instinct for the ring. How do you find an answer for those natural talents, Corey? If you're waiting for Austin Theory to make a rookie mistake, it won't happen. You have to seize control of the matchup and force him out of his comfort zone. He steers clear of contact. Heavy body shots. Whipped hard. What a clothesline. What's going to happen here? Backbreaker. The damage he's taken is starting to pile up. And that'll show people what Williams is made of. Oh, oh man. Inverted backbreaker. Ow. Theory is bleeding profusely now. That's mounted with punches. And not. Oh, a nasty stomp to finish it off. Knew what Trick had coming. Placed into the corner. Williams had that well scouted. Oh, man. This is just establishing dominance. Oh, Ooh. what a stop right to the chest. Are you kidding me? Looks like Trick has taken the upper hand. Yeah, Theory's getting forced out of his comfort zone here, and his opponent is in control. He's really slowly getting up. Uh, look out, through the air, and connects! From ring post to ring side, risking it all paid off. From delivering a Uranagi, huge offense from Trick Williams. Hungry and refusing to stay in the background. Big forearm. Opportunity now for Theory to capture some momentum. Austin was getting grinded down, but could have just started a quick turn. Oh, he grew tired of his smug attitude. Oh, what a knee strike. Trick nailed it. For this young man. It was certainly a treat for all of us to watch here tonight. This superstar can now enjoy his victory. Oh, what the hell is he doing? Oh, no, not the steel chair. Come on. Oh, oh my God. Him. This is absolutely heinous. Totally uncalled for. He's out of control.
A hungry Lucha talent. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, representing the LWO from Cordoba, Veracruz, Mexico. Weighing in at 190 pounds, Cruz Del Toro. Cruz Del Toro looking to carry on the legacy of Lucha Libre tonight. He's ready to show his skills without Legato tonight. The OGOC in the building. Always ready for action. Aimed at the opposition like a machine gun. And his opponent, representing the OC, by way of Tokyo, Japan, weighing in at 200 and starting the action. That is some unsportsmanlike conduct. Oh, give me a break, Saxton. The referee issuing a warning here. I wanted to see this match. I hope the ref doesn't call it off. Well, I actually agree with you, Saxton. And that prevents any offense from Carl. This arena can't contain them, and if history's any indication, nothing good's about to happen up there either. Gets him with the counter. Bam! Down he goes. And a Oof. stop to the gut, too. Facing off at the top of the ramp. I don't know what's going to happen, but it's going to hurt. You have solidified your name as a top athlete when you're able to pull off that move. Anderson can shine as a singles competitor, but what's the biggest hole in his game from your vantage point? The brother Carl's a lot of things, but big ain't one of them. If you have size or a power advantage, you've got to use it to your advantage immediately. This is a pretty dangerous place to fight. Screens, exposed metal, ledges, so much could go wrong very quickly. Thrown back in under the ropes. Superstars in the ring, and the referee officially starts the match. Well, this is the way we're starting, Cole. I think the WWE Universe is in for quite a show tonight. Kick! Uh-oh. Carl wards that attack off. Solely focused on punishing the leg. And El Toro didn't like that one showing up in the spotlight. Oh, God. That looked devastating. Punch lands. Arm drag takedown. He could do it here. He forces a break before the count of two. It's not over yet. Plenty left to go in this one. Oh, man. Invert. This could be it. Cover. Power right out and one. Strong kick out, but you have to wonder if he can keep it up. Anderson with a rocket kick. Right on the money from Anderson. As always, you know what? Anderson muscles up. Uh-oh. Gets dropped. Timely reverse DDT. Close line. Heads out of the ring. What's next? Go on. Oh, breaker. He's starting to struggle here. Well, all things considered, Cole, it's not a bad condition to be in at this point in the match. Looks like Carl Anderson is locked in on his opponent. 
And he's taking this to the outside now. trying to get under his opponent's skin. Oh, the rope step. Incredible. Plancha. Absolutely throwing all caution to the wind. Spinning in the face of danger. <laughs> and Carl Anderson is getting the crowd going. Not allowing that to go on any longer. Is it enough? And Cruz Del Toro scores the victory. Here is your winner, Cruz Del Toro. Cruz Del Toro comes away with the win. Yeah, but you can't keep a good brother down for too long. She is a woman who is here to take control. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making her way to the ring. Representing Damage Control from San Jose, California, Bailey. You know, with everything Bailey has accomplished, I still wonder why is she just so unpleasant, so hostile all the time. Well, maybe you should just mind your business, Saxton, because you're talking about the first women's Grand Slam champion, the first women's Triple Crown winner. And not only is Bailey physical in the ring, but she can uh, beat you mentally as well. Yeah, Bailey's new attitude was very upsetting for fans who had supported Bailey for years. You include yourself in that group, Saxton, because I find it apropos when Bailey calls you an idiot. She doesn't mean it. Does she? Oh, yeah. The whimsical Wendy Chu. When Wendy Chu gets pushed, oh, she'll bring it. And I don't mean the pillow. And from Chinatown, New York, Wendy Chu! Wendy Chu, always dressed for comfort, but more than ready for a fight. And you definitely don't want to get run over by the Wendy Choo Choo train. Yes, I do. A real train. Facing one of the most talented in-ring competitors, but now also has to contend with Bailey's mean streak. Well, she is certainly going to have to tap into her ultra-aggressive side to overcome Bailey. Action has made it back to the ring, and we can officially start this match. Oh man! Yeah, the refs. Say good night. Sleeper hold locked in. 
Oh, could be night night time. No, no, maybe not. What a counter. Oh, what a close line. She's on unsteady legs in the corner, needs to recover. And wow, what a super kick. And here we go now. Elbow drop to the knee. What now? Belly stop. Oh. And a loop. Uh-oh, four, I'm gonna cut off the wind. Guillotine o'clock. Dangerous situation, needs to find a way out fast. And she does. Great move. What is she thinking here? Oh, DDT. Belly loves to be in control of the match to dictate the flow. Corey, is there an easy way to turn that against her? Oh, absolutely, Cole. If you can disrupt Bailey's rhythm and make things difficult for her, she'll start to get very frustrated. And even the best superstars get sloppy and make mistakes when they're flustered. Getting set up for something in the corner. Bailey, what's she looking for here? Oh my gosh! Will this be enough? She breaks the count quick. She likely knew that wasn't enough. She's just keeping the pressure on. Oh, using the knee as a weapon. Got the leg and jumps the elbow. And Chu caught sleeping, as it were. Yeah, and Bailey's clearly bringing the fight here, effectively ruining Saxton's theory of taking shortcuts. Oh no, there could be trouble lurking for her with this submission maneuver. And now the leg placed in a dangerous position. Trying to show how bad she wants to stay in this match. Ooh, what a forearm club. Combats out of that. Shoulder tackle. Oh my goodness, dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. Look at this, Bailey going up top. And the top, all the way to the outside. Soaring through the sky and crashing onto their opponent. with a level of disdain that's honestly kind of unnecessary. Of course it's necessary, Saxton. Bailey just put the competition on notice. If you get in her way, she'll get mean. And there's the, the cover! <laughs> and that's a big win right there. And I'm going to check on a... Oh, hold up, hold up. The, this superstar... No, oh, come on, this is uncalled for! Now, what does this prove?
Here comes the unholy union. Yeah, and they... Saxton! Byron, what are you doing? Get out from under the table. We got a match to call. Uh, leave me alone, Corey. The following contest is a tag team match scheduled for one fall. Making their way to the ring, the team of Isla Dawn and Elba Fire! These two women are self-proclaimed practitioners and scholars of the dark arts. And they're not afraid to use their dark powers to get ahead in WWE. Mischievous, devious, cunning, all part of Fire and Dawn's dark personas. The Scottish sorceress is ready for action. They are enchanting, they are sinister, and they are downright dangerous. Thea is here. Oh, hell yeah. yeah. First, representing Chase U from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Having come straight out of high school to NXT, Thea has made it clear she doesn't want her youth to define her. Yeah, Thea Hale wants to prove that she really is a grown woman who can hold her own. And that means no more waiting, no more asking for permission. Time to stop being a student and start teaching lessons. Thea Hale is a true ball of energy with endless potential. She's been living up to that potential and is ready for the next level. Well, time will tell if she's got the aggression to get there. When you're Becky Lynch, every night is a perfect one to start a fight. Let's go get him! And from Dublin, Ireland, Becky Lynch! She is as tough as they come. Yeah, Becky Lynch has had to overcome countless challenges in her career, both in and out of the ring. You know, she's the first female competitor to hold two world titles at the same time. There we go. Superstars finally enter the ring and we are officially underway. <laughs> Stops the kick. Oh, man, right on the jaw. That'll ruin your day. Sorry, European uppercut. Uh-oh. High angle belly to back suplex. Take her head clean off her shoulders. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Tag. Good. That's right. And the ball right to the nose. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. Yeah. 
Complete control right now. Look out. Oh, what a way to shatter an arm. And Isla didn't figure out a defense for that maneuver. Yeah, yeah now it's about Thea maintaining some of this pressure. Double leg takedown. Stop. Big form. This is going to hurt. Doomsday Saito. And she'll make the tag. to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Got the head scissors on. Sharp elbow. Her shoulders are down. Big shoulder up. Still a ways to go in this match based on that. Back body draw. Did you see the height on that? She turns it right around with a counter. Here's a tag. Opponent off the ropes. Double big back body drop. Tandem offense in effect. A good team knows how to truly work as one. She gets it. Held in a perilous position. Ooh, right to the throat. Tying up the legs here, looking for the death lock. There it is. This is how you punish your opponent. Go oh, right to the kidneys. God, please. Ow. Foot, meat, back. Quickly slip behind. German suplex. Not look at this. Oh, just exhibiting their fearlessness. Exhibiting guts and accuracy as well. Becky just mocking her now. I think these superstars are actually fairly eager to test themselves against one another. That means they recognize each other as being legitimate threats to their own ambitions. Oh, fellas, we are looking at a mounted thrashing here. Getting ugly in there. Out of control. Practically never-ending blows. Coming at full force here. The ultimate sign of disrespect. Out of the way in time. Boom, German suplex. She's not done yet. She shows that she's far from finished. At this point, this is incredibly ill-advised. You're in the middle of a match. Able to get there in time. Stomping. Ouch. And Alba perhaps not the only one with a killer instinct in this one. Yeah, Becky looked as locked in as ever there. She scurries out of there. Oh! Becky Lynn. Uh oh Alba shifts that to her favor. She's holding on tight. And Alba got bottled up there. Enable the counter. Kick gets caught. Oh, elbow to the knee. That'll hyperextend your leg. Take down to the mat. Well, bridging. Fujiwara. Oh, man, that's. She's in it. Desperately trying to find a way out, and she does. Up across the shoulders, right into a spine buster. She's going for it. And a strong kick out in one. Unbelievable display of will in the late stages of this matchup. And a tag there. Oh, 
look at the mounted thrashing. Goodness, calm down. She returns the favor there. For a pump handle, pump handle coming. Boom! Incredible suplex. Here's the pump handle. Suplex launched. Basement drop kick. Things not going how she'd like. This is what the purpose of a tag team is. Don't be afraid to use the resources and help your partner offers. Am I being diplomatic enough, Cole? Dawn with a nice turnaround. Roundhouse kick, man. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. So she tags in. Oh, what a tackle. You've got to be agonizing for the arm. And there's the tag, Becky Lynch into the ring. Now oh, look at Becky, manhandle slam! Cover! Coming to the rescue! And for some reason, she lets go of the hold. Could have just been a tease of the potential agony that's yet to come. And the WWE Universe is making their appreciation for these gladiators known. She is not done yet. Big for him. Oh, what a clubbing blow. Right back body drop. Lynch saw it coming. Drop kick hits hard, lands harder. Tag switching it up. Absolutely haphazard, uncalculated risk. And I have no doubt they're going to pay dearly for it. Bang! Three. Four. Mm. Oh. Yeah. The Van Gogh of WWE daring her opponent to rise to her level. Have to head back into the ring now. Yeah, count's running out. Ooh. Ooh, ouch. And she met. Thank you, Lynch. Disarm her. Good job getting on the ropes there. Yeah, that could have been bad. She's about to rise up to something catastrophic. Taking flight. And that was offense with a hurtful purpose. Here's her tag. That holds back Hale's attack. Hooked up. Not the time to wallow in disbelief. Pressure must be kept on. Boom! Slam! With authority. There's not a single person sitting in this arena. It's pandemonium, Cole. Oh, this the superstar using the rope as a weapon. This is uncalled for. Come on! Alba Fire digging deep into the arsenal here with the goal ball. For the win. Two. Out. Ah, celebration underway. Great win tonight. Really needed that one as well. Oh, is it great? What? Oh, oh, we got.
Another superstar is, uh, I guess, adding to the celebration. Appreciation? I sense a hint of sarcasm in the celebration. Yeah, you're probably right. Here comes a truly vicious superstar. And Drew Gulak isn't here to play nice. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Weighing in at 193 pounds, Drew Drew Gulak ready to tie the competition up in knots. Drew Gulak is a walking compendium of wrestling knowledge. Well, that's how Gulak balances the scales against bigger opponents. Ready to outsmart and outfight anybody. From out of the shadows, Uncle Howdy is here. A being who seems to dwell in the darkest parts of our minds. Might be a spirit, maybe an alter ego, perhaps an evil twin. The truth is, we just don't know. Looking at the face of Uncle Howdy, it is truly a frightening sight. Just that creepy mask alone. And I shudder to think of the pure evil lingering under that mask. Yeah, you're not the only one, Saxton. These are the ultimate mind games being played by Uncle Howdy. We've seen Uncle Howdy's attacks have devastating consequences, but what happens when he steps inside the ring to actually compete? Well, Byron, we're about to find out, and I've got an ominous feeling it's going to be horrifying. And now this match has officially begun. I'm not even sure the word official is in their vocabulary at this point. I think you're right, Saxton, and I love it. One hand! 
It couldn't have felt good being sucked around like that. Gulak turns it around. Incoming. Big time power bomb. I felt the vibration of that one from all the way over here. Oh, that can prohibit any use of their shoulder going forward. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. Drew Gulak's deep arsenal can make him a pretty intimidating opponent. So what's the number one thing to keep in mind when facing him? You can't let Gulak take you down to the mat where he can get full control of you. Keep Gulak outside his comfort zone by pressing the attack at all times. From the top! Elbow drop! Good lord! And Uncle Howdy just got met with some fearless offense. A truly impressive kick out this late. Looking to apply an agonizing armbar stretch. Just stretching out the arm. Shooting pain in the shoulders, the kind of thing that builds and builds during a match. Insulting. Such punishment Gulak is dishing out now. Gulak with a systematic attack. This one could be over. him with the counter. He's finally finding an answer to that onslaught. Huh? Uh, nasty stops. And this superstar. Oh, wait a second. This Come on, bring it. We know this music. Allow themselves to be destroyed. Look at this. Here we go, guys. Dragon Sleeper locked in tight. Oh, no. Whoa, whoa, look at that. And somehow he's able to work his way out of the hold. Uncle Howdy getting worked on right now. Uncle Howdy has to weather a storm here. Watch this display of power. Ooh, dang me. That's got to be it. How in the world did he kick out? Drew Gulak. Gulak with the Jokerplex. Will it be? Kicks out. So, so close. That could have been it. Going way up high. From the top. Oh, straight to the floor. A gruesome landing. I don't know how you walk away from that. Drew Gulak. Submit. Just hang on. Hang on for just a. Oh, rolls through. Nice escape. Boom. Great biting the legs. Kick to the body. He's going for it all. He's lining him up. Soaring. Oh, it's through Senton. Oh, this is just too far. Get some control in there. Oh, look at this aggression, just oh, pure brutality. Come on, easy. What on earth is coming next? Gulak is now starting to bleed. Trying to wrestle free their opponent's arm, has the arm trapped. And a series of vicious stomps. The close of this match is just ahead. These are dire straits for him. He needs to be extra cautious now. Maybe all that studying Drew Gulak does needs to come to the surface somehow. The advantage is turned toward Uncle Howdy. This is good stuff. Pressing the attack and keeping Gulak outside of his comfort zone. Powerful contact by Gulak. An anguish on Uncle Howdy's face as he takes on such a hostile force during the course of this match. Boom on the jaw. Saw that coming. Close line. Boom. Drop kick. 
And this one might be headed ringside. Oh, man. As the wrist trapped. And this is just next level brutality. Oh, tossed hard into the ring post. A warning and a challenge from Gulak. Gulak looking for the high risk move. The ref still counting, might be a count out. Launching. Oh, look out. No matter who you are, when you crashed on the floor, a searing pain races through your body. He's burying elbows in the midsection. And now thrown back into the ring. him out of the submission hold. Could have been a strategic move to wear down that body part for something bigger later. growing with every second that ticks past in this match. Just disrespectful. Gulak turns it around. Uh, our bar. Punishing stretch. Stiff kick. Uh oh. He's returning fire. Don't do this. Howdy looking to embarrass his opponent. Whoa! Slingshot sent on to the outside. 
That was coming in hot at breakneck speed. Going fast and living dangerously. Uh-oh. Carefully measured. Oh, man! Leg drop arm breaker. He'll head to the ring. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Getting up, but doesn't have a clue what's coming at him. From the top, good lord, taking flight. Showing absolutely no apprehension to putting one's body on the line. Oh, man, leg drop arm breaker. Stiff elbow will break that up. from Gulak. just how much the previous distraction shifted the tide of this match. Tried to stay vigilant the whole time, but it proved too much in the end. Look, you have to celebrate the fact they won it all by themselves. Were you watching the same match, Corey? They clearly had some assistance. Okay, Saxton, and in basketball, does the person who throws the assist get the point? No, my point stands. What? The referee starting the matchup. Oh, and that's oh, one way to get going. And the referee's down already. The match just started. That fist of cuffs from the opening bell. This thing's going to get ugly. Someone's going to get seriously hurt if this continues like this. These two are going to tear each other apart. And I love it. Is that an official start? The referee was able to start the match, so we are proceeding with this match. Yeah, guys, there is no way that doesn't play a part in this one. Saxton, in this business, you've got to keep your head on a swivel, no matter who you are. That was just a quick reminder. Oh, man, that was nasty. They weren't that good looking anyway. Oh, man. He didn't need that eyebrow anyway. We're at home that there's a cockier superstar in all of WWE than LA Knight. First of all, it's called confidence, Cole. But I will admit, it could possibly be used against LA Knight here. Because this match may just come down to who's more focused. Climbing the turnbuckle from the top. And he goes for the pin. He gets the shoulder up at two. He's still in the fight, but for how much longer? A little rope assistance attacking the arm. That kind of force in the arm can have lingering effects. Slip blade by Rollins. 
Seth Rollins is in complete control. L.A. Knight's struggling a bit. His confidence is being used against him right now. And a reversal by L.A. Knight. Knight managing to get some control back now. Now's a chance for Knight to get back into this match. Big time knee, Lariat combo. Ooh, got caught with a punch to the face. from not kicking out next time. Oh, goodness, what a moonsault. Rollins, here comes the stop. Trying to stop and got hit by an RKO. Countered it just in time. Sharp knee. For the middle rope. Going airborne with the bulldog. He's taking some good hits. Spine buster. Shoulders down. And he kicks out of the pen in one. I can't believe it. He just won't go away. L.A. Knight kick to the cup. B.F.T. Rollins may be laid to rest. Is it enough? The cover. Oh, and he just kicked out. I cannot believe it, Corey. Seth Rollins is still alive. Next level fortitude from Rollins. And there needs to be a refocus now. That was the moment that could have ended things. A moment that's being replayed in their heads right now. Perhaps thinking about what to do next here. Oh, right across the throat. Big punch finds its mark. These two are clearly fired up, going blow for blow. Ooh! Nothing pretty here, just good old-fashioned fisticuffs. Giving up now is not an option. They have to finish this. And he scores a reversal on Rollins. One reversal after another. These two are reading each other's minds. Metal rope forearm on point. He's on his heels a bit now. This is where endurance becomes so important in the late stages of the match. The stars elbow for the win. Two count. Finally ends it. And all the bloodshed, perhaps worth it now. Here is your winner. They might not be in the best shape right now, but they have to be feeling good after that win. Coming back after being on the receiving end of an underhanded attack and winning it all? Impressive doesn't even begin to describe it. Some might say lucky does, though. Oh, no, this is not luck. This is fortitude. This is grit, Corey. A uh, lot of history between these two enemies. Stare down in the center of the ring. They have been waiting for this moment for quite some time. It is about to go down. Here we go. Massive matchup. I can only wonder what those two were saying to each other. Well, I assure you it's not for the faint of heart. These two can't stand each other, and we're about to see what they're willing to do to each other. He goes for the quick pin. Could have been a flash finish there. Oh, 
That was just malicious. That just was disrespectful. A shot like that to the ego could really shake you up mentally. And the forearm smash. Reigns has his opponent in a fireman's carry and then driven down with a flapjack. Taking it outside the ring now. Isolating their opponent's arm and oh! Goodness gracious. And now Rhodes can't stop this momentum. Yeah, Cody's having trouble fighting back. And Roman Reigns demanding acknowledgement from the WWE Universe. And a bionic elbow. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. Uses the edge of the knee. Come on! No one likes a count out. Planet with the bulldog. Can you believe this? I love it. I don't know if they're going to have any taste buds left after that. Placed he dropped in the skull. All oh, the momentum has swung to Cody Rhodes. Cody has that fire in his eyes, and Roman has no answer. Rapid fire Samoan drop. Any advice for Cody Rhodes as he takes on the very formidable Roman Reigns? Cody's going to have to use everything he knows. Every attack, every strategy. Against Roman Reigns, your one best shot just isn't good enough. But I think Cody knows that, and he came here tonight ready to give Roman all he's got. Oh, oh look at this ruthlessness in the bottom turnbuckle. <laughs> Assaulting the knee with purpose. <gasps> Boom! He's absorbing some tough hits now. And the only thing on Roman's mind is to mount more punishment. Rolling into a monkey flip. Just a perfect mix of pure power and bad intentions. Nice suplex. And he goes for the pin. Oh, he kicked out. You have to think this battle is starting to weigh down on him. Uh-oh. This isn't going to be pretty. Oh, that was scary power. On oh, the back of the neck. Off the rope. Oh, man, he has fired up now. Big forearm. Slap! I don't know if there's any ounce of professionalism in an attack like that. Knew what was coming there. Reigns is going to look to press on the advantage. Yeah, Roman was able to momentarily stop the blue. Oh, by Reigns. Terrible position for Reigns. Look at for the victory. Two. And celebration here tonight that was a massive victory for this person you can say that again what an impressive victory a hard-fought battle and now the victor can enjoy let's not lose sight of the effort delivered by that competitor even in defeat gave it their absolute all in this matchup unfortunately sometimes your all isn't good enough wait a second oh, don't do it don't do it Thought frustration was going to set in and uh, get the better of them there for a moment. This superstar will certainly live to fight another day.
Just an eerie hush has taken over this entire arena. We are in the midst of an instantly intimidating presence. No one knows what to make of him. The dangerous mystique of Bray Wyatt. Wyatt is as twisted and demented as they come. With Bray Wyatt, you can only expect the unexpected. stared into the abyss and he liked what he saw. He's back at NXT. A man who has completely transformed himself mentally and physically. Really uh, went through a resurgence in a rebirth when he returned to NXT. Had a new attitude. McIntyre now laser focused. Continues to dominate everything in his path. Weighing in at 254 pounds, the Scottish Warrior, Drew McIntyre! Sword or no sword, Drew McIntyre is a dangerous, dangerous man. McIntyre is as physical as it gets. He is not afraid to get down in the dirt or throw hands. Defiant, bold, Drew McIntyre bows to no man. He is as in your face as they come. A mass of man ready to go to war. Explosive, like a lit stick of dynamite with a very short fuse. Often called the czar of NXT. Right now, Ilya Dragunov looking to expand his power to all of WWE.
superstars in the ring, and the referee officially starts the match. Well, if this is the way we're starting, Cole, I think the WWE Universe is in for quite a show tonight. Gotta find a way to get out of this. Lands face first. Sky high! Way up there. Well-executed suplex. That had to... The sleeper hold is cinched in. Time to go night-night. Slick, he breaks up the hold. He's been placed in the corner now. Plants him. Oh, close line. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. Pulled back into the hip toss. We didn't expect that. The Kimura. The Kimura. Oh, uh, Kimura. And he breaks the hold. And one more reversal. Talk about evenly matched here. Planning on what to do next. Oh, my God. A sledgehammer. This is going too far. Corey, what sort of game plan works for a superstar going into a triple threat match? You absolutely need superior ring awareness. Far too often we've seen superstars forget about the other opponent and they end up getting blindsided. That is press. I think Rage took over in that moment. Nothing but blind Rage. DTO! I don't think Ilya enjoyed taking that attack head on. And Wyatt was just doing what he does best, inflicting punishment and loving every second of it. Down with a suplex. Sent on. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. Producing a trampling. <laughs> Big back body drop. I don't even know how gravity allowed that to happen. Insane strength to send someone airborne like that. Kragenov controlling the pace now. This is Ilya firing on all cylinders. Backhand hits the target. Uh-oh. Makes the cover. And he stops the count. Pulled back into the hip toss. I've seen Saxon thrown out of a few local bars like that before. Oh, please don't remind me, Corey. Boom! Oh, what an uppercut jar. He's getting pushed out of the defensive. Hanging tough as this match progresses. No easy task in a triple threat match. Flash goal kicks from this. He can end it here. And he powers out. He's determined to keep this matchup going. Oh, goes down face first from the Gord Buster. Is it enough to overcome Bray? Ripcord. Oh my goodness. Nasty line. Drew fending him off. Forbidden Moscow. Exclamation. We got a cover. Cover could have been it right there. What are they going to do here? Oh my God. No, that's too far. Bray Wyatt. Oh gosh. This part freaks me out. This is absolutely unsettling, and it does not bode well for Bray's opponent. And neither will this. Six. Sister Abigail! And it looks like Dragunov is bleeding after that. Oh, man, the McCoy! Tires in dire straits. Two count. Got it. Survived the 
triple threat match. Here is your winner, Bray Wyatt. The WWE Universe showing appreciation as all three competitors after an amazing triple threat match. This was an unpredictable one, but when it was all said and done, only one man could be left standing. One man out of three. It was always bound to lead to a little chaos. Hello. The buzzer.